about Julia. And Julia here is an agriculturist, which means she works with the birds. She's also an aquarist, and she works with a lot of different animals here at the aquarium. So, hi, Julia. Hi, Samine. How's it going? Great. How are you doing today? We're, we're doing good out here. You know, to get us started, I had a couple questions about these penguins. Maybe I'll start us off, and then maybe you can take some questions from our audience here. Absolutely. Okay, so one of the questions I get all the time is, why are penguins black and white? Because why would you want to be that color when you live out in a big blue ocean? So can you talk a little bit about that? Well, certainly. Well, penguins are black and white, and they look really cute on land. They look like they're in their little tuxedos, formal wear. But actually, the black and white coloration really helps them out where they spend a lot of their time, which is out in the ocean. Um, penguins, black-footed penguins eat mainly fish, and so they spend a lot of time out in the ocean chasing after fish. And if you look at penguins, you'll see that they're actually dark on top and they're light underneath, which is called countershading, and it's a type of camouflage that a lot of animals that spend a lot of time out in the open ocean use to stay hidden out in a big blue ocean. So imagine for a moment you're a penguin, mm, and you're hungry, so you're chasing after fish, and you're diving down really deep, and there's a predator above you looking down when you're black, back blends in with the dark sea layer in the ocean and it's camouflage. Or, you know, it's been a hard day out chasing fish and so you're up at the surface, catching a breath, relaxing, and there's a predator below you looking up. Well, your white belly blends in with the bright surface layer of the ocean and again you're camouflaged. So, not only do they have fantastic style sense, but they're also dressed for success. They really are. And what's funny is